Hey, folks, and welcome back to Glenn and Adrian's Rock Talk. That's Adrian. And that's Glenn. And today we come back to you with a Love Bites track that was on Battle Against Damnation, which was their second EP. It came out in 2018. The song is called Break the Wall. And this was a request. It actually comes off of the Zep Diversity Tokyo gig from 2020. And so we're going to take a look at that. Adrian, do you have any thoughts ahead before we start? I'm just looking forward to hearing this song, this uh, early Love Bites song. Yeah, it's pretty early in their in their catalog. All right, let's go ahead and check this out, then we'll talk later.
was thinking early Metallica, like Master of Puppets. Oh, yeah. It kind of reminded me of different things from that album. Uh, and Gallop of Death, and then there's a uh, guitar solo that uh, Midoru was playing. Was, uh, it kind of made me think of Slayer, like you know, Jeff Hanneman. <laughs> yeah. Or Kerry King, either one of them. You know, it just sounded very Slayer. You know, and then there's the other yeah, Miyako. guitar solo. Miyako. Yeah, Miyako. Yeah, and just plays a guitar solo over a much mellower riff, you know, kind of like the middle of Master of Puppets. <laughs> and it just goes into this classic riff after that, you know, um, the very common riff, but it's still exquisite in this setting. You know, I totally got 1986 thrash vibes. They have a lot of those um, those early origin influences. However, yeah. I haven't heard them sound exactly like that necessarily. Like, yeah, there was something in particular about it that I uh, that I liked that was a little different. Especially starting up the song, they have acknowledged it too that they have those influences, mm -hmm. and they're you know, and it's a proud thing. And and uh, I'm glad they're playing music like that. Oh, you know, so am I. Yeah. Yeah, I mean they're see, writing. This is like they're they're like bringing something back to life here. It's the way I see it. Yeah, it's almost like a reanimation, but with you know new and improved on it. They're making really great music. It's fantastic stuff that that adds very nicely to the whole. And I mean to the whole idea of uh, thrash in in general. Reminds me of why I like this band so much. <laughs> is that, yeah. that was really fantastic, and it was a little bit of a different taste of Love Bites for us. Yeah, it was. It was pretty different from what I'm used to hearing from them. Uh, here's some uh, info from the wiki page. Bassist and leader Miho wrote the foundation of Break the Wall, while Miyako then added color to the composition. Miyako mm -hmm. wrote the guitar solo in the middle with Gary Moore in mind. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can hear that now that, now that they mention it. Drummer Haruna called it their most aggressive song to date. Yeah, it kind of had that rain and blood like vibe yeah. you know, to it. Well, cool. So that was an interesting, that was a cool suggestion. I'm glad we looked at that. I'm not sure we would have seen that. In general, we try to avoid things that aren't already hosted on the Love Bites YouTube channel, but we thought we'd make an exception for this one, and I'm glad we did. Folks, if you have other suggestions for us, please leave them below. And let us know what you thought about this as well, if you weren't already familiar with the piece or uh, any history you have with the song. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And if you enjoyed our presentation, please subscribe. All right. Thanks so much for joining us. And we'll catch you on the next one. All right. Take care, folks. See you all later.